You don't need much to do the demonstration. To use the laser, you literally laser the water or the food for 10 seconds. And during this process, it's transferring the information through the laser beam. People wonder like, what frequencies are on it. A laser is only one frequency. But it's about the information that's embedded in the laser that gets transferred through the laser beam and gets picked up by the water. And that's where we get the effect. So now what we're going to do is do the balance test. Again, have the person stand with their foot off of the ground and go over to the side which the foot is li lifted off of the ground and gently press down. Okay? Now I have the person drink the water. I just need to take a sip and then retest. And now we're in a very strong center of balance. Okay, now we're going to be talking a little bit more about the Vita Laser and the practical application and how we would use it with food. So down we're here now we have a couple of examples of, uh, of a beverage, water, tomato, and an avocado. So typically you would just go ahead and laser whatever it is that you're going to be consuming. By lasering your produce before when you just come home from the, the supermarket, you can actually extend the shelf life of what would otherwise be perishable foods that may go out and, uh, and become uh, putrid or rotten within a three or four day period will now extend that, the shelf life of that significantly. So 10 seconds is all you need to do to be able to do this. Uh, the benefits that you're going to be receiving is, is that you're restoring vitality into the food. The food will actually taste better. You can do a great test with wine where you take one glass of wine that you don't laser and uh, test another glass where you actually laser it, have people smell it, and then taste the difference. There's a significant difference in that.